Thank you. Uh, welcome once again. Uh, when Dave was showing the video of the, the uni robot, as I would probably want to call that, I was reminded of a colleague of mine in a company I used to work for. That guy was a human uni robot, actually. And uh, very funny thing, he used to actually walk in the cafeteria like this. And we used to think, oh my goodness, let him not go close to the window there because it was always scary who's going to take care of the liabilities if something happens to him. But just to bring some energy level in the room there, with your permission, I want to do a very small experiment. Now what Dave shows us was a video, what I would like to call that with, uh, Dave, if that's okay with you, is a mobile agility, right? I mean, there was a device that was actually mobile, and it was trying to control itself through an internal PLC or some mechanism. So it, was, it had a feedback mechanism, it was trying to do that. How are you game today morning for a static agility exercise? Would you like to do something like that? Yeah. Okay, so the energy levels are a little low, so I hope it helps all of you. So it's a very simple exercise. Um, anyone has been to China? Okay, so I'm claiming that it's a Chinese exercise. <laughs> please, please don't call my bluff. But I believe it's a Chinese exercise. So what we are going to do is, you all will stand up at your seat, right? And let me just explain you so that you, you get the thing. Now the Chinese believe there are six meridians that, that pass through each of these legs. So what they do is actually, you take your own position and you try and control yourself and stand as much time as you can. And it's very easy as you can see that I'm standing, but you have to keep your eyes closed. And that's when the fun begins. And you do this and then you do this like this. And it's supposed to create a lot of energy in you. Now let's see how much of us are cut out for a static agility, right? You have to keep thinking, your mind has to be constantly agile. A lot of knowledge that Dave talked about, I think you have to really feel it inside your mind to be able to balance yourself when you are actually keeping your eyes closed. You see, I cannot, I cannot even do it for a few seconds. So I hope we have a last man or a last woman standing at the end of that exercise. So with your permission, if you all would like to stand up, and at the count of three, yeah, no, no cheating, right? Don't hold anything. Right? Uh, make yourself comfortable. Don't poke into, don't poke your elbows into your neighbor's eyes. Uh, just find your position that works for you. And at the count of three, close your eyes and stand on your right leg first. And as soon as people keep falling down, just sit and watch others how they are doing. Let's not disturb the ones who are able to do that, right? Okay. So one, two, three. I guess we'll stop. We have three winners here. Let's give a big hand to all of them. I also want to give a big hand to the last woman standing. Uh, Ma'am, what's your name? I think you were the one who were last standing. Deepa. Deepa. Give her a big hand. Thank you. How was it? How was it really imagining when you have all your inputs? You're flying blind, literally. Actually, you're standing blind. And you have no inputs coming to you except you are just sensing the air. 
and there's a lot of dead air because when, they, when, they, when there's nothing really happening there, and you still have to be agile, right? How was that for being a mobile agility, right? I just coined a new thing here. Okay, so with that, I just want to stand here uh, for next 10 minutes and just introduce the program today for all of you. Uh, Uh, as you all know, we are in the day four for, uh, of, of the largest conference uh, uh, in Asia that we have, we have been doing. I, I want to just share a few of the things. Uh, once again, thanking all the sponsors, making it happen there. Uh, would not be possible without all the active support from, from sponsors and the community. And this has really been a great effort uh, uh, planning this. I, I've been happy to be a part of the team that Naresh and Pramod have been leading. Uh, we, we have this fabulous bunch of speakers here and a and, and lot of authors here among, uh, in the midst of us. Uh, I just want to make a brief mention of the team here. Uh, I myself have not been able to meet up my own team here physically, so uh, uh, Naresh is here. And I want to actually take this opportunity to also uh, see if, if Pramod is here. Yeah, Pramod here. Ellen. Hi, Ellen. Ravi is there. Uh, Doc. Okay, uh, so, and, and, and that's the last is me here. I just want to call out my own team here, Jerry. Uh, maybe Jerry is not here, Ted. All, Ted, is, Ted couldn't come, all the way from Australia. And the other team members, Srikant, Pradeep, Prasad, and Eben. Okay, I see here. Hey, thanks guys, thanks for making it here. Uh, so, <laughs> I also want to uh, take, a, take a, a few seconds out and actually call out uh, Naresh for the leadership that he has been providing to the community efforts here. This is the 10th year running, and I believe this is the ninth conference in the 10th year running that it's been happening there. And every year, as Todd, you would be happy, uh, as, as Dave, you would be happy to serve. We have been incrementally raising the pitch. We have been just getting better and better all the time. We have been getting uh, a fabulous uh, set of speakers here. The attendance just keeps increasing all the time here. So I just want to call out Naresh. Thanks for all the help. Thanks for all the leadership and guidance here for making it happen for all of us. Uh, as you can see here, uh, we have. Uh, we have a, a lot of, I mean, the statistics speak for themselves. Uh, a great uh, bunch of uh, happenings here going on. Uh, we are in the day four, uh, technically the last day of the conference, and tomorrow we are going to have the first Agile India job fair, the first of its kind. Uh, don't tell your company if they have sponsored your attendance here, right? You probably don't want to be expensing that. So we are in the day four here with the Agile, Beyond Agile, uh, and uh, these are, uh, this is the day you already have the schedule here with you. Uh, I do not want to repeat it all of you because you all have it. There's just one change here. We'll be having the tea break right after uh, this small session. Uh, and uh, Victoria's session on Agile coaching uh, is not happening. She couldn't make it. So we'll be having a short Q&A session in, uh, uh, in the room where it's meant to be. So, so uh, Squire, Esquire, yeah. Okay, thanks. Uh, some other hygiene announcements. So the DVD of these will be available. Uh, uh, look out for uh, a mail that will hit your mailboxes in due course of time once all the DVD recordings are available there. Uh, they'll be available for payment, so you can make the payment and buy the DVDs. I hope you have been giving your feet good exercise, or I hope you have not been giving good exercise to your feet. Because I, I, I would like to believe that we have been able to uh, have a, a great set of sessions for you. But yes, please exercise law of two feet. If you don't feel happy or you feel that you would be better off in some other session, go ahead and do that. Uh, we, had, we, we were also in touch with a lot of other speakers uh, who were, because of other prior engagements, were not able to make it to the session. Uh, and uh, what, what we did was we actually uh, held a series of Hangouts uh, on Google Hangouts. And some of these are available now, so you can actually go and have a look at them once again if you'd like to do that. Uh, we will also be having a book signing by Dave today uh, uh, during the uh, coffee break, right outside in the bookstall area. Uh, there are books available for purchase. You can purchase them and have uh, autographed by Dave. Uh, and if you have your personal copy of one of his books, then that, that's also okay, but use the time when we have the coffee break there. Uh, this is about the job fair that we are going to have tomorrow, the whole day there. Uh, hopefully, we want to build a, a different kind of ecosystem here uh, because no marketplace can really truly sustain if there is no demand and supply. So we want to make sure that we, we have a bunch of practitioners and, 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 and thinkers, we want to make sure that we are able to get people to come together and, and, and have a direct connect with them. 
So it's a great community effort. Uh, I hope uh, most of you or all of you are able to come there and make it a success. It's an experiment by itself, and I hope uh, for the interest of the community, we succeed in that. Uh, is uh, Richard here? I guess Richard is not here, uh, but uh, we'll probably have it a little later then. Um, the Agile Art, or Naresh, you would like to just... So as you guys know, we've been uh, doing the Agile Art event uh, in all the receptions during the evening, and uh, we've put together the final art piece, uh, and it's there for uh, viewing. A uh, lot of fantastic uh, art uh, out there in terms of the Agile India logo and a lot of creative stuff done. Uh, so we'll leave it out here for people to, you know, take pictures or watch it and, uh, you know, get inspired with the artwork. In the evening, when we do the closing talk, we will actually dismantle it and people can take these art pieces and go back to home as a souvenir. So come back again here during the closing note uh, if you would like to pick up one of these art pieces back home, right? And thanks to Richard for organizing this whole art event. I think it was a fantastic opportunity for people to meet and network. Thank you. Thanks, Harish. I also want to uh, make a forward announcement for two of the conferences that uh, we will be uh, conducting. The Functional Conference, uh, and you can go to functionalconf.com, uh, April, mid of, mid of the month. And uh, Selenium Conference is, is going to happen uh, in September timeframe, so you can go to these links and follow up and sign up for more updates on these. Uh, just a small word on feedback. Uh, as you, we are probably already told in the last few days, we are not collecting any paper feedback. Uh, we are not collecting feedback on the dead bodies of trees. Let's put it this way. We would like to connect, collect your feedback electronically. So uh, if you were happy, uh, tweet with Agile India 2014. If you were not happy, let, let us know so that we can fix it the next time. Right? <laughs> you, can still, you can still tweet it. Uh, that's perfectly OK. I mean, I'm not saying that censor it. Uh, do make it a point to give us a chance so that uh, we can improve it the next time. I mean, uh, I would feel shortchanged if you, if you did not tell us and you just went on social media, which you all should do by, by all means, but do give us a chance so that we can, we can help you correct that the next time. Uh, I think the Make a Friend happened uh, some time back. Uh, so how many people here have not, are here for the first day here? Very few people, so I guess we had this fun exercise, but I, uh, I was trying to see if, if we have uh, a way to do that. But I would encourage you the rest of the day to make some friends uh, and go back with, with some, some, some more of your network uh, as, as it happens. Uh, we are on on Twitter. I, f I hope the Wi-Fi is uh, working for all of you. So with these, I want to just, uh, so these were some of the few hygiene announcements. Rest of the program remains as it is. Uh, only the 10.30 uh, will be changing now. And, uh, uh, hope to see you all at 5.30 when we have the closing talk here, uh, and we'll see whatever. I know it's been a long conference. Day four, Saturday is your family day, and many of you are probably have been away from the work as well. But do make, a, make it a point to be here by 5.30 so that we can, we can do a wrap-up, and we can, uh, we can listen to all of you. And if there's anything that you would like us to do the next time better, uh, please give us a chance for that. Uh, with that, we will be uh, breaking for the tea and coffee, but just one more thing. I would request all the speakers to come here, we, could, we would like to take a photo, group photo with all the speakers here. Uh, so I would like to call upon all the speakers to come here, but um, uh, we can break for the tea and coffee, but the speakers can please join us here. Thank you. Sorry? <laughs>